everything with Y, one side of everything with X and the other side. So as you can see, if I have to put this one, I have to multiply everything by Y plus 7 and divide everything by Y plus 7. So as a result, I'm going to have Y plus 7 or Y that's what we have here. So basically now I'm going to integrate both sides. But this side is easier to yeah. to integrate. So I have x cubed over 3 plus x plus c. And this side, what I'm going to do, I'm going to do long division because I have y on top of y at the bottom. So I'm going to do what long division. So y plus seven. Y plus seven. So it's 1. Yeah, so I can replace well, that one by for 1 plus 14 uh, over y plus minus 7 is y. Yeah. But this one is very easy now to integrate. Yeah. And this one is y. Yeah, it was 14 I couldn't take the network of I heard really like my son is satisfied here. So, so it's like X cubed. Alright, plus X. Plus C. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Now, what I need to do, I need to find the value for C. By plugging every time I have X, I have to plug 0 and 8 for Y. If I plug 0 for this one, for X here, I have 0 here. I have 0 here. If I plug 8 for Y, I have zero here because if I put eight on the right, natural log of one is zero. So what I have, I put eight for this one. If I have to C, C is equal to Y, and C equal to eight. So now finally I have to write the equation because that was my purpose. So Y plus 14. At least you can explain it. Y minus seven. X cubed by 3 plus X plus 8. And that's the equation of the solution. That's the solution of the equation. <laughs>